Oh, my name is Sam Bing. I'm with Lenovo here. Uh, so what is this? This is called Star Wars Jedi Challenges. This is like an adapter for phone? Uh, like a, a super VR headset. What is that? It's, uh, okay, I'll, I'll start it from the, from the top. So yeah. it's not VR, uh, it's not an adapter, but uh, it's a AR headset. It's called the, our Mirage AR headset. And AR I'll, headset. It's an AR headset. Are you you slide in your phone? Yeah, you? simply slide in your phone into the product. And then insert your phone inside the headset. It's like you're feeding your phone to the thing. Yeah. You plug it up, and it turn and you turn it on. Activate your lightsaber. It comes. The device comes oh, no. with with your lightsaber. Okay. Okay. I see how this works. And a beacon. And the beacon acts as your your, your reference point, so that the device knows where the floor is. It's running a game. It runs a game. Mm -hmm. it runs a game developed by Disney and Lucasfilm. That's using the camera. It uses the cameras for uh, tracking, location tracking. It has two cameras. How yeah. does it connect to your phone? To the phone? Uh, through USB. Oh, so uh, you need a phone that supports a USB host? A, uh, no, no. The adapter comes with it. That, that adapts for what? Yeah. To adapt to any phone, you can use. Uh, we have the Lightning adapter. You have a, uh, a USB-C adapter, a micro USB adapter. Is it like uh, not guaranteed that every phone can support external cameras? Uh, you don't need to support the external cameras. The, the, all, all the, um, the support is built into the headset, so your your phone doesn't need to support any. As long as it has the output port, the um, the port, the output to the headset. So it, what is it doing with the it's cable? It's sending. So what it's doing is these cameras, they track the light from the lightsaber and the beacon, and it sends that data to the phone, so that the phone knows where the position of information is. Kind of like a mouse. Data. Yeah. Similar, like I guess that. you could say that. Yeah. So, but you do need on the go. You need OTG support on the phone, right? No, no, you don't need OTG support. Right. Yeah. So, uh, and then, uh, th could it also connect as Bluetooth or? Uh, no, no. Well, this the lightsaber connects via Bluetooth, but the the headset connects to the phone via the cable. Okay, so and uh, as you were showing, can you slide it out? Yeah. Uh, Actually, it, it seems that part of the screen is covered, so it's not mm -hmm. using the whole screen? Yeah, it's not using the whole screen. That's that's for universal compatibility. So how much inch do you put in there? Uh, well, this is what, about two and a half inches by one, two, three, four, about well, five inches. So um, it's like kind of like a four inch iPhone or something like that. Uh, as a display that splits up in two sides. Yes, correct. And it has all kinds of uh, optics, Optical, optics, optical system to make a uh, AR. Yes, correct. So uh, is this for sale? Yes, for sale. It's available at Best Buy right now for one ninety nine US. That's amazing, no? Yeah, it's yeah. affordable. Yeah, very affordable. It's Lenovo. Yeah, very, it's, uh, yep, Lenovo product in conjunction with Disney and Lucasfilm. I'm just gonna jump yeah. in here one second. I'll be back. <laughs> Ah, I got my butt kicked. Come on. <laughs> and it's a whole progression system. So the game starts you out as a Jedi uh, looking. You found uh, an artifact. And this artifact teaches you how to be a Jedi. And you run into uh, a character that teaches you how to be a Jedi, how to fight. Uh, there's a strategic combat game, so it's kind of like a tower defense game where you learn military strategy. So it progresses you through the game. You go from being a Padawan all the way to a Jedi Master. Uh, you upgrade, you gain upgrades and unlocks. Um, you fight different uh, bad, bad guys all the way from Darth Maul to Darth Vader and Kylo Ren. And also, um, your light, you can change your lightsaber colors as you progress through the game. So, it's very better, neat. It looks better if your phone has a high pixel density. Uh, sort of. It doesn't really matter too much. Obviously, as you, as you saw, um, it cuts the device off. And with the optical reflections, you know, it doesn't make quite as big of a difference. What kind of phone are you demonstrating with right here? Uh, we have we have uh, Moto Z's, and this is actually an iPhone, so you can do it. On, you can do it on any Android or iOS device. Is it a large game? A large it game. Has many levels. People that don't get tired of it. Oh yeah. Um, the game playthrough is 12 hours if you sit through it, play it straight, and you're, if you're able to defeat every level one try. <laughs> 
So, and yeah. Only one game. Uh, one game, Jedi uh, Star Wars it's Jedi not Challenge. Open platform for everybody. No, it's not an open platform. It's uh, specifically developed by Disney for that for that experience. And it launched together with the movie. Uh, I launched just ahead of the movie. Right. Yeah, uh, early December.